Android devices, not safe. Nope, not from external threats, not even from their own users. So please be careful with those third-party apps, guys, please. Okay, that said, even if you happen to be a bit careless one day, well, at least the better antivirus apps for Android should at least help you out if you ever slip up, right? <laughs> Hey, it's Mike, and yes, it's cybernews.com time, and we're ready to show you the best antivirus options for Android. We're even going to leave the best deals for the premium ones in the description, so go check those out. Now, let's start with a very common question. Do you even need an antivirus for Android? It's a good question, since Android doesn't even have a proper antivirus built in. Google Play Protect <laughs> barely counts as antivirus protection especially if you're installing third-party apps or browse unprotected web content. And that's exactly why we're forced to use apps like Bitdefender, Norton, or TotalAV to prevent online and software threats from getting into your device. Bitdefender is a great option because it's probably the most secure antivirus for Android. Besides the usual malware scanning, it has anti-theft tools, web protection, VPN, and some contextual recommendations. You know, like based on your battery usage to optimize the performance. Personally, I think Bitdefender's remote control has to be one of the top antiviruses for Android. You can lock, run malware scans, and even wipe your data all remotely. And you gotta do it through Bitdefender's website. Now I can imagine a few situations where that might come in handy. Bitdefender for Android also claims to be effective against coin miners, ransomware, and many other threats. Plus, it has third-party institutes backing up those claims However, and some of you regulars know this is coming, I ran my own malware test, which showed that it took Bitdefender around seven seconds to scan my device, which is great. Unfortunately, it only found seven of the 10 malware threats that I planted. So yeah, I think we should expect better, shouldn't we? Now, even though the Bitdefender antivirus for Android app is weaker than its desktop counterpart, well, at least it's optimized for Android devices. Yeah, I might be a little biased here, but I think this UI and the features are very user-friendly. Even without knowing where everything is, I managed to navigate Bitdefender's mobile app quite effortlessly. Bitdefender also has a free version, which makes it possibly the best free antivirus for Android, even if the free version is a wee bit limited. And for the reasonable price of about 15 bucks a year, you get mobile protection for a single device. Or you could get a total protection plan to cover more devices. The pricing is still reasonable, but I'll leave some extra discounts for Bitdefender and some other options in the description below. All right, next antivirus worth mentioning is Norton for Android. Compared to Bitdefender, well, it's just not as versatile. It does have a malware scanner, online protection, a VPN, and password manager, but at the same time, it lacks the anti-theft features that I like in Bitdefender. Out of all the features Norton offers as a mobile antivirus, I think the best are System Advisor and App Advisor. I can always count on them detecting operating system threats or potential app privacy breaches. But regardless of how good these features may be, I need to make sure this antivirus can actually deal with malware. So once again, I performed a malware test. To spare you the dirty details, it took Norton about 16 seconds to sweep through my phone, taking out nine of the 10 malicious files that I planted. Now, significantly better than Bitdefender, sure, and it's only marginally slower. So this kind of performance is almost what I'd expect from the better antiviruses for mobile. Now, unlike the very simplistic Bitdefender app, Norton for mobile is more stylized, yet still simple to manage. It's just full of menus, each leading to a specific feature or function, but I found it just a little bit harder to navigate than Bitdefender overall. Interestingly enough, the difference in pricing is really small. Norton's price is about the same as Bitdefender, but it only has a free trial when purchasing the full antivirus package. And my third pick is TotalAV for Android. If you don't need specific feature to cover your Android phone and are only looking for baseline security and malware protection, then TotalAV offers exactly that. Now, it doesn't boast a lot of extra features other than a VPN, Wi-Fi security checker, and web shield. However, TotalAV has an effective malware scanner, but only if you're focused on apps, which means that TotalAV detects malicious apps rather than files, which, now that I think about it, feels a little sad. I couldn't even get to my own malware test. TotalAV detected zero malicious files. <laughs> you can guess how unfortunate that is. We'll never know. Hmm. 
In terms of ease of use, Totally V for mobile gets points for its slick dark theme and a search bar right in the middle of the main screen. It's great, it's easy to navigate, but mm, probably could benefit from some optimization. Oh, and that safe search feature doesn't always work either. On the other hand, Total AV is the cheapest of the bunch if you consider the entire service. Unlike Bitdefender and Norton, it doesn't have a mobile plan. Instead, it offers basic antivirus that includes a free license for mobile devices. See how that works? So this makes Total AV a better deal because you're getting a full antivirus, but less if you're only focused on getting one for your mobile. Okay, so let's summarize. Bitdefender is the best Android antivirus for 2022 if you care about versatility and some of those extra features. At the same time, Norton will provide you with the best antivirus in terms of security measures and has a nice little anti-malware scanner. And Total AV might not be a perfect mobile antivirus, but it does offer baseline security for those who need an antivirus for their desktop and mobile at the same time. And all three are available with special discounts. Yay! All you gotta do is click the link in the description. Real hard. <laughs> all right, thanks for watching. Let us know in the comments if you think we need to add an antivirus to our Android devices list. Give us your opinion. And remember to stay safe out there because I wanna see you in the next one.